Hello everybody, I am Bramian19 and welcome to episode number two of our France campaign in uh, Europe and Universal 4 as we're playing at an Emperor in 1.30. So, last time we fought the English to get Maine back, which we did, um, and we're gonna, we started focusing on trying to get some of Aragonese land and building up our spy network to do so. We are so much stronger than he is, he is not friends with Castile yet. It's actually a pretty good idea to try. Um, just getting whatever we can from him, start building up. I would love to curb um, Castile's power, I guess. Unfortunately, I don't have the ability to ally anybody um, or anybody else just because I don't have enough stuff. Anyways, uh, ooh, okay. Let's do that. That's fine. We're doing just fine here. Provence is no longer excommunicated. Truce is expired. Truce is expired. But we've allied Brittany again. Uh, we're going to hopefully build that up into a very great relationship where we can vassalize Brittany for ourselves. So yeah, we'll use that to our benefit. We're going to try to kind of get all of France and then get most of Iberia by the end of this game. Um, you know, I might keep like one bit of Castile in place. And that's about it. Uh, we'll lose it to Prestige. And like one bit of Portugal. So they can be out there colonizing still. But they can't be, you know. And hopefully they won't be able to get taken over. <laughs> so uh, I think I might do that. Alright. Can you add one more troop yet? Actually, yes. Um, We'll add that guy. I'll just have 20 of each for right now. And then there's investing in new technologies. We're going to do Diplo for the marketplace. There's no new institution yet, is there? Yeah, there's no renaissance formed. Swiss born 1450. So yeah. Then you go enlightenment to industrialization, by the way. That's going. That's a new institution we'll talk about as we hit it. Because this will be a long play. No reason why we shouldn't do a long play of this one. It's going to take me a long time to go get Moscow and all that stuff and, you know, maybe do revolutionary France. I'd love to see this thing actually go revolutionary France. Just, I've never done it before. To any nation, actually. So, Aragon, fabricate the claim. I want, um, Rosselo. Right? Is there anything, is there anything else I would want? Provence, Toulon, Annex Saxony, Annex Genoa, Helvetic. This is some of the things we're just trying to find. Subjugate Lorraine, conquer Milan. French claim to Na uh, Naples. Yeah, that's something eventually. Spanish secession. I'm going to want to take all that eventually, but nothing with Aragon, surprisingly. It's almost like we were supposed to really be friends with Aragon, and we're just not going to do it. <laughs> okay, uh, fabricate claim. I'm not supposed. To, if I can't be friends with him right now, I'm going to focus on taking stuff from him because, well, that would be better off. So Rousselo, Rousselo, get a claim. Let's back it off. Bring troops to here. Bring troops to there. Yeah, Burgundy is beaten up on Provence pretty hard right now. Claire, uh, we'll have everybody but Scotland and Brittany. It'll be 46,000, 10,000. Uh, so 56,000 on, yeah, pretty much 39,000. There's Lucca and Florence out there. Florence is over here. 
Lucka is there. Okay. There we go. I'm going to send my troops straight here, even though they're going to get there before me. All right, let's take a look around. Are we going to be able to walk to these places any, or...? Yeah, like that. Okay. We'll go ahead and head that way. These guys are going to be here to watch over. Uh, we've been excommunicated by the Papal State for attacking somebody. Yeah, this Papal State sucks. <laughs> I don't like him at all. Uh, gain the... We're gonna need, oh, I didn't even notice that that had been taken. So we're gonna sit our men here. We're gonna see if we can get rid of Lucka and all these. I don't want to take it. I just want to not have to worry with them. Is he a military level? He is. A, no wonder. That wasn't smart. I didn't even realize he was ahead of me in tech. See, this is the kind of stuff I haven't played in so long. Did I lose an entire army? Wow. That game is cheating. Okay, um, well, I'm gonna have to get another army here, so let's work them up. Are these guys at four? Yeah. Up oh, there's the Renaissance. go we'll get those guys rolling in pull off of that there you go let's even these up I know that guy's a pretty crappy leader Uh, 50 admin or 50 diplo. I'm probably going to go with 50 diplo. No, we're going to go with the admin. I hate to do it, but I need to. There we go. 14% right there. Can I, like, hound my estate? Like, I don't think I can do that kind of stuff anymore. Um... Yeah, I don't think I can. That's weird. I wish I had it. I mean, I would be able to sit there and add, you know, I could probably request for at least a hundred. Um, ducats or something. Not 100 ducats, but 100 uh, ad or military power. So I can get level 4 and then be able to utilize my troops. Yeah, there's no beating this army with what I have.
That's oh, cause that's the official Florentine holding. Okay. Lucka wants out. Gain ten. Let's go there. Yeah, we've lost Narbonnet. Which had ships in it. I don't know where he went. Come on, let's get a wall breach and end this. We're getting close, come on. February 1454. One more year. One more year of me being an idiot and starting this war too soon. So I can get into this. Uh, air falls ill. We could spend 50. How good is my air? Pretty bad, so let's just pray for him. <laughs> Probably would still survive. Like, my luck, that kind of dude survives every time. France's uh, opinion of Provence. Provence's opinion. Nobility goes up by 10. Okay. Is it negative 14? We're slowly marching our way to a higher uh, military power. Right now. We'll take this, take this, and I might just throw everybody in on one. We'll do that. Mill churches. This is a, yeah, hills, so they're gonna, yeah, dice rolls minus one for me automatically. And when I have worse morale to begin with, it's not good. No, Lucka, I want you to have to stick around a little bit longer, buddy. A gift from Castile of 65 ducats. Thank you. I can't, I shouldn't build anything with it, but I could. I'll focus it in case I need to like buy up some mercenaries or something. Okay, two of a kind. Queen Adelaide has a point. Be for, uh, becomes an advisor at the court, or she's an, uh, the army organizer will get 50. Yeah, I need that 50 more. She's a Forense. We'll do this. Send him to Pisa. Let's give ourselves about a month to reclaim uh, some of that morale that we just got. Yeah, we just took him completely over. Go ahead and start marching here to Narbonnet. So let's go ahead and say, um, Florence, I don't want anything from you. I just want war reps and money, which you will do. Um, anything else that's interesting? Rele you could re have him release Pisa. Um, get rid of that alliance with na uh, the Papal State. And then with... Lucka when that guy comes back. Four reps, all your money. Um, you have an alliance with Genoa, which I don't care about. I'm gonna end your alliance with Aragon though. There you go, I got two guys back. Send him there. The, those guys are going to go here. Now we've ran out of manpower, but the good news is, well, we've come, we've caught up in tech. So
Um, lose 25. Okay, we'll go here. We'll let these guys take over everything again. Um, if you're going to do that... I'm going to leave him the rod on his own. We're actually going to start getting manpower back. There's a win. Can I sit you on this? I can. I can pull you up. There and there. Now he's not stuck in, but at least we've got a bit we we're okay. There's some pretty high war exhaustion out there. Come on, get there. Okay, well, we won. Um, Nobility's going to gain 10 influence. Aragon's no longer a world power. We're going to end their rule of these things so we can even have a chance. Yeah, him owning this is what really hurts us. Yeah, make him walk back. Okay, we'll keep going back and forth, dude. It's fine with me. There we go. That we're bringing in even more troops now. Unfortunately, it forced us off of all of our uh, forts. Once I take this, though, it should be an easier matter. We can take the war into his lands. These guys can be allowed to focus. Probably leapfrog him a little bit here. Um, Diplo rep plus one. Diplomatic negotiation costs minus 15. For how long? Five years? And that's enough. Like, I'll be able to get a few guys done. So let's do that. Good. Now we've got Girona. These guys can just sit on places for a little bit. We'll let these go. 0%, negative 21, negative 7 with the wall breach. This wasn't a, the best war. I should have been, you know, 4 to begin with, but it's okay. Castile has declared war now, too. Um, let's go ahead and take taxes or manpower. You know what? You can never have enough manpower. Taxes eventually is going to work out for us. We'll leave these guys near enough to each other. Let's 
Oh wow, he actually beat us. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Something I didn't expect to happen. Maybe not full front lines and such. Spread these guys out a little bit. Okay, there's another one. We're at 4% now. Uh, let's go for... Papal Influence, and there we go. We're at 10%. Lost a leader. That might be something. Oh, wow. We got a much better one. Let's take it into his lands again. Let's see what we can do with uh, taking all of Barcelona or something like that. Yep, we're, spa we're stacking on top of him. Does he even have any more troops? He's got apparently 45 somewhere. Alright, now we're sitting here. Nowhere I can really go. Yeah, now we'll see we've got Yeah, Aragon's gonna let us get something off of him. There's a Navara out there, which we don't really care about. We will want that. Couldn't get Barcelona though. Um War reps. Hmm. The large puzzle mounts five sixty. Okay, we'll wait. That's at zero percent now, so it's very much worth uh, the Milanese succession. France gets a restoration of Union Cass's belly on Milan. That seems like a wonderful thing to have, doesn't it? Okay, beat him here. All right, there we go. Zaragoza is now ours. We got all that. So the mo oh no, not the total most. Okay. Um, if I set up one in Barcelona, they still won't give it to me. But hmm. That seems pretty fair. Okay, took some land. It's not the end of the world. Go ahead and send these guys back up here. I'm going to actually... I'm going to get rid of that in favor of the other one. Do these, let the war exhaustion go down. We do have some 26,000 French noble rebels possible and 8,000 Catalonian. So, 
War exhaustion's pretty high, though. That's a major contributing factor, I'm sure. Autonomy's pretty high there. I can do a little bit, so we'll do that. Okay. You're going to sit around down here. You're going to go up here. All right, I think we're fine. Um, I've got a lot of money, so let's start thinking about what we're going to do here. Go get that done. Rebel Uprising with the French Noble Rebels. They're going to start going down over time. They're at 90% though. And they will rise... To the north. Let's go ahead and bring these guys up here. Being at peace, we should be able to knock that down. But no, of course they, they went at Paris and Lyonne. Yeah, fall back. You fall back here. Actually, it's technically okay to wait on a little bit. As long as they don't get a wall breach or jump down to like 7%, we could wait a little while and get some of our manpower back. Oh, we lost the Restoration of Union. I thought that was much longer. I thought it was like a five-year type deal. Bring these guys down here. National Unrest minus one. Could have used that a little while, you know, a little while ago. Building up my troops. There we go. We're doing fine. Come on down here. Golden Bull. Golden has development cost minus five and tolerance of heathens plus two. Okay. Well, we didn't fight the smartest war, unfortunately. So that's going to hurt me a little bit. Um, war exhaustion is the majority of my uh, issue here. War exhaustion over extension go away. This guy is going to be at like 0.5. And I guess he will go down with separatism, yes. And this guy here, war exhaustion, okay. Yeah, I'll be fine. Military power, but that'll return. Doing pretty well on money. 2.12, meaning I can spend up... Yeah, I can get another guy. National Tax Modifier. Then we'll go ahead and do one more. Approve Relations. Okay. Alright, guys. Well, I'm going to have to end it right here. Um, not a bad episode. I would have been better if I would have checked the tech first and made sure I had level 4 before I attacked Aragon. But that's okay. It ended up going in my favor anyway. Um, got a lot of money out of the deal, got two provinces, 
Um, so yeah, I'm I'm happy with it. it. It could have been better, but we'll live, right? No big deal. So, all right, guys, I'm going to end it right here. Appreciate you all so much for watching. Do not forget to hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, comment as well. And uh, check out the links for Discord, Twitch, and the Patreon in the uh, description below. So, all right, guys, I'll see you all next time.